this player. The hugely talented Tommy Hutchison was an ageless Peter Pan in football boots when John Bond brought him from Burnley to Swansea six years ago. He's an example to the youngsters, that's for sure. Anybody in football is, is, is 37, 38, and he's as fit as a fiddle and he enjoys it. He enjoys everyday training, he enjoys playing. He plays as if he enjoys it, he likes winning. You get a few of them about, you see. There was, there was the likes of Norman Hunter and Bobby Moore and Martin Peters and Alan Ball and those people went to football clubs. Tommy is in their grade of football, you see, and he's, he's, um, they come every so often. Creating chances for others has always been Tommy Hutchison's trademark since he left Alloa in his native Scotland 23 years ago to continue his career in the Football League. I was lucky enough to go down to Blackpool when I was about 18, 19. And uh, at that time, players, obviously the staffs were bigger at clubs. And I think when I went down there, they were in the second division. And there was something like 45 pros on the books. Uh, and at that time, players like Jimmy Anfield and Johnny McPhee and uh, that type of player. When you got to 30, 31, everybody took it that, you know, it's time for packing up and finishing. And I thought... Um, like everybody else, well, if I get 10 years in the game, I'll be well pleased. As it happened, that was a 10-year apprenticeship I had. After Blackpool, it was Coventry, 17 caps for Scotland, then Manchester City, and that unforgettable Wembley game against Tottenham. I think it's a cup final that nobody will let me forget. Can Reeves get this one back in? Well, Ransom might with an early ball, played it there. Scored my ball on my head was a it was a bonus to start with, but uh, I, I still look back and think I still wonder why I went in the position that I did going for the, for this first goal. And I felt more disappointed for the lads, you know. I felt like I'd let them down. That's one goal Tommy would like to forget, but there have been others that he remembers with great affection. That's mainly because there haven't been too many of them. Just 55 in 858 league appearances. On average, that's about two and a half a year for 26 years. Well, what a player would have been if I had a score goal. <laughs> and I think, uh, you know, when you see goal scorers scoring goals, that is only pleasure to get out of it. And I do get more pleasure out of uh, creating goals and making goals for other players. I'd like to think I've gave something to everybody. The biggest thing to get out of me is my enthusiasm and uh, willingness to work. And... Uh, and just wanting to play the game properly. And uh, I think if they work along those lines, uh, they'll, they'll have as long a career as I had. And although you've hung up your boots officially as a first-team player, you're still going to be contributing, yes? Yeah, the, the, I've hung them up, but I haven't nailed them up. They, they know that they can still come off that peg. Joe, what a tremendous advertisement for the game Tommy Hutchison has been, isn't he? Yes, Tommy. Um, it was a great sight, you know, to see him running at, uh, at full back, scoring both ways, inside, outside. I remember playing against Tommy when I was at Cardiff and he was at Blackpool. And of course, um, Coventry Liverpool matches. You know, I remember one, one game in particular when Tommy picked the ball up and ran at another ex Swansea player, Tommy Smith, you know, yeah. and ran past him and Smithy brought him down. <laughs> And Tommy got up and said, hey, Smithy, he said, I'll race you for your wages any day of the week, you know, which he probably would. And Tommy stood up and said, that's fine. Tommy says, and I'll fight you for yours, <laughs> which we all thought was quite quite funny at the time. But a great player and a good advertisement for the game, as you say. Yes, meanwhile, Joey 